What up, YouTube? It's your main man, Boys for Life, coming at you with another fucking video. All right, so I'm gonna just get into this. I'm gonna shout out to the TCE, the CNS, Cowboy Nation, the CWO. Now I'm gonna sound a little bit more lively today because I had a couple of a couple of brews before I left my softball game. I have a softball game right now. So, but anyway, we're just gonna get into this video because. I wanted to, I was gonna make this video and post it yesterday, which I did make it and I did say some things, but I didn't post it because I wasn't wearing any cowboys things, any cowboys attire. So I wanted to put my cowboy hat on, redo this video, and have a good time doing it. So we're gonna jump right into this shit because <laughs> wow, the shit that I no, I was gonna go. I, I I didn't even talk shit about the Eagles, not the Eagles. Fuck the. The, the Cardinals. I didn't even talk shit about the Cardinals in my video. All I said was, they're on a four game win streak against us. They got a depleted offense right now with Fitzgerald on the back of his career, Carson Palmer being 36, and David, your whole offense and David Johnson is gone. I get it, you got Chris Johnson, you re-signed him after you let him go. You re-signed him to bring him back, whatever. Anyway, and I'm coming out with this video because there's some fucking idiot the retard of the Cardinals fans. Have you heard this guy? Have you heard of this guy? Ragging Rod or Rob or I don't know. It's, it's ragging something. Anyway, this guy. This guy's a fucking moron. He wants to come on video and talk or on YouTube and talk about how, oh, this guy doesn't know what he's fucking talking about. He has no idea where what he's talking about or blah, 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 this and that, whatever. Well, my bad. I didn't know that you, what your record was. I'm not worried about y'all because... Y'all have no effect on my division whatsoever because we're going to beat you, first of all. We're going to beat that decent defense that y'all have. We're going to run all over you, actually, is what's going to happen. Uh, mm, our defense is going to actually rebound and do bad. I'm sorry, Carson Palmer is going to get sacked about two or three times this upcoming game. So, yeah. Um... Rag and Rob, or Rod, or Rob, whatever. I don't even know what the fuck, remember what your name was. But, Cowboy fans, this guy, I mean, I don't even know how to explain how he speaks. Because he has this annoying, God damn it! Why do I don't even know what that means! Because that's how he fucking sounds. That's how he fucking sounds, I'm not even kidding you. And I know, like, a lot of people on here like to go on YouTube and bash other people and say, oh, he's on drugs. He's, he must be doing meth. Like, I get it. That's original, right? But obviously, like, if you've seen this dude, his videos, when he was making that video about me, I kid you not, he stood up and turned around and went behind him for whatever reason about five or six times in his video. And the way he was all jittery, and blah, I was like, bro, sit still and talk. I mean, he has to be on something. I'm just, I'm just throwing it out there. And plus, he lives in a, he fucking lives in a ho hotel? Like, are you fucking kidding me? You live in a fucking hotel, like, I don't even know where the fuck he was shooting this from, to be honest with you. I actually thought it was from a van, and you had computers behind you, I don't know, but it was extremely dark in your video. All I saw was you, so I, like, I don't even know where the fuck you shot this from. But anyway, I really don't even know what else to say about you, man. Like, you are the local retard of your fucking fan base. And it's sad that, that that's all you got to represent y'all. Because we know how horrible your offense looks this year. Like, it's not even funny. Like, it's not a joke. It's funny that you want to say that the Cowboys, or like, you didn't say this, but people are saying the Cowboys have been exposed. The Cowboys have been exposed. They had a fucking bad game. That's what I hate about talk shows and news reports and all kinds of bullshit is that they make up so much shit. That's like, are you, are you fucking there? Like, they're not allowed to have a bad game every once in a while. So anyway, all all the all the Cowboys have to do is get back to their game plan and running the ball, running the ball, which opens up the passing lanes over the middle, short five six yard passes like we do after we get those five six yard runs dump it off five six seven yards whatever 
And then later on in the game, the 30, 40, 50 yard passes open up. Like, that's the formula that works. And that's what we're going to keep doing. And against this defense, this decent defense that there is, it's no problem. And then your offense is garbage. Like, you have nobody. Like, I was watching Carson Palmer against the, 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 the Colts, and he was making throws that he was throwing the ball, and it was falling short. Like, his arm strength was gone. So, I'm not too worried, bro. Like, Rag and Rob, or Rod, or Rod, whatever the fuck your name is, you, you, you honestly look like a knockoff of Rob Kardashian. And I only know who the fuck that is because it's all over social media. So I know what he looks like a little bit. And you're almost as sad as him. You're like the lowest of the low knockoff brand. Like, you know how you have Oakley and then you got Folkley right underneath and then you got all this other fake shit? Well, you're like at the bottom, bro. Like, at the very, very bottom. It's crazy. It's ridiculous. But, like, you, you want to sit there and talk about how I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about? Like... Everything I said against the Giants that was going to happen, happened. Except I don't even think Tucker got a sack. But we almost scored 24 points. I told, I even said in my Giants videos that Perkins wasn't going to get no more than 50 yards. I don't even think he broke like 30 or 40 yards. Like I don't even think that happened. So, and then your non-existence of a run game after David Johnson is hurt for more than half the season... I'm not worried, bro. Like, your team's garbage, first of all. Your team is fucking good. Your team puts tries to put so much talent together, and then y'all do nothing with it. Not even make the playoff. Nothing. Like, it's ridiculous. Like, it's, 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 it's ridiculous. I'm sorry. Like, I mean, great. I'm glad you're a fucking fan. I'm glad I get to talk shit with somebody from this fan base because your fan base, your, your, your team is just, it's just shit. Your offensive line is about to be destroyed this weekend. I'm sorry, it is. And your run game, like Chris Johnson, if he is a starter, which more than likely he's going to be, he's going to get no more than 40 yards in the run game. That's a guarantee. I will promise you that. After giving up 100, which the Cowboys had not done at all last year, gave up 100 yards receiving or 100 yards rushing. Actually, scratch it. They gave up 100 yards receiving last year to Antonio Brown at the very end of trash time. I mean, it wasn't trash time. It was like, we're going to play deep in the end zone so we can stop Antonio Brown. And he ran a good, like, after he caught a 30-yard pass, he ran for another 30, 40 yards, which gave him the 100-plus that, that, that he had, which gave them, which gave the Cowboys, you know, the 100 yards, giving up 100 yards to a receiver. But after that, they didn't give 100 yards up to nobody. We just had a bad game. Like, don't even sweat it, bro. Like... I'm excited for Monday night. I cannot wait. But anyway, this video is getting on too long. Rag and Rob, you want to make fun of my name? Get off your rag, dude, because that's what you sound like. You sound like a little fucking bitch on your fucking rag. Bro, put a, put a tampon in and call it a night, man, because I'm done with this shit. Like, it, tomorrow's Saturday. Tonight's Friday. If you want to put a video up, put it up tonight. I'll watch it tomorrow, but you're going to end up getting the last laugh because tomorrow's Saturday, and I put up no videos. Now, if you put up shit early enough, I may come back at you with another video on the way home after my softball game. I don't know. But it all depends on you, on when you see this. So, anyway, you have a good time, bro. You bet, you you go in Monday night, stretch your shit, and just watch your team get dismantled. Your offense is going to get destroyed. Your defense is going to get fucking manhandled. Your team's going to get bent over and ass fucked. That's what's going to happen. It's going to happen, I promise you. Anyway, Boys for Life, I'm out. Peace!